M0FXB, welcome to my videos on the ICOM ID52 and ICOM705. M0FXB, we're looking at, going to look at the amp draw on this uh, Zygu X6100. We're using one of these. It's, uh, it hasn't really got a make, but it's a watt meter and power analyzer. So let, I think they use them on... on um, solar panels on people's roofs but they're very cheap only about a tenner so anyway let's try it out so let's uh, at the moment we've got it all connected the load goes to the x100 or 6100 the source is 12 volt battery which is reasonably charged it's giving us 10 volts at the moment so it's not fully charged but anyway so right now if you look at what we're showing, 0, 0.00 amps, and um, it says here 9.40 and 4.4 WP. So, 0 0.10 amp hours. So, let's plug it into the radio, see if there's any change at all. Because it does charge the radio. Let's just zoom in on it. It's now showing 0.25A. 4.4, 0.011AH, 0.1WH. But the, the main one I think I'm looking at is the 0.25 amps that have been drawn. Okay, and the, the voltage, you can, you can see the voltage is going down. Let's turn it on. Let's take you do have to sort of hold it for a couple of seconds anyway it's on we do have an antenna connected but not a very good one but it's just better than nothing okay so now it's on there's no transmit nothing at all uh the screen is on number three let's go higher let's go to number five and we'll draw in 0.62 amps Okay, so let's 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 try the tuner. Um, so we've left it on five watts. We we'll, we'll, we'll mess around with the different power settings when we transmit. So let's tune. As it tunes, look one point one zero amps, one point fourteen. Okay, and it did tune. I mean, we've just got literally a 40 metre uh, whip lying on the floor. That's how pathetic it is. And we're still actually receiving some stations. Uh, let's just show you that. Try to, anyway. Right, and I'll just show you the antenna. Just to show you how funny it is. Right, wait there. So it's just a whip lying on the floor. I could stand it up, but I'm just doing the tests. But it, it, what I like about that is that it shows that, you know, this radio, you know, does work. There's no problem with it working. Right, so let's do um, 10 watts. So we'll go up to 10, and you can only select 10 if you've got a power supply connected. And this power supply is only um, the battery. But I will swap it to my um, proper power supply, and then we'll see the difference. But first of all, let's do the battery. So let's test. So we're showing same amp draw as before, really, a little bit higher, 1.16 to tune. And then let's go right down to the milliwatts. Because it's a possibility that it, it, when you tune, it, it, it defaults a certain amount of power. So let's try it.
yeah, the same. So, right. So, let's actually transmit now. So, we'll just give it, we'll come off away from those people. We'll keep it on the low power. And look, it's picking up quite a few stations out here on that whip. You can see them all in the peaks. Let's get the RF gain right up so you can see them a bit. Anyway, no one's there. So, let's, um, 0.1 watt. Let's tune again, then we'll whistle. Right, ready? Yeah, same, 1.11 amps. So let's go to full power. Now you can actually set the power to be here. If it's not, you just go radio settings, turn the multi knob, let's get this out of the way, turn the multi knob here to TX power. And then, and then at the bottom here, there's a tick you can select tick it and it puts it there just in case you haven't got it there and that goes for some of the other most of the other functions as well so let's um have a whistle on uh, 10 watts yeah and you're, you're really seeing it there about 1.80 amp draw okay well that was interesting now let's put the um the my power supply in line just give me one second to set that up so we're here with the mfj switching power supply so we've got the full 13.8 volts going in and right now the amp hours are naught as you can see so first thing we'll do is uh connect the dc supply to the zygu And it will start to charge. See the light, the green light flashing there. Okay. So we're now showing 0.23 amps being drawn from the power supply. Uh, and the power supply is actually showing 15 volts, where the battery was only showing nine or 10, but we've got it on the setting where it's 13.8 and we could turn it down. But it, it's within the tolerances, yeah, we could turn it down. But I'll leave it where it says, because it says up to 19 volts. So, we can see that draw 0.23 amps, and it's turned off. Then we'll turn it on, hold down for two seconds. And this is the fun thing about the um, X6100 is that we've got a tuner, so we can actually test it tuning. I couldn't do that with the 705, because my tuner is uh, in a different place. So... All up and running. We're, on a, we're still on that 40 meter whip that's just lying on the floor for tests. Uh, power wise, we're on 5 watts here. So let's tune it. And when we tune, let's see uh, what happens to the draw uh, on 5 watts. So the draw is going to 0.94 amps. It's going to struggle tuning because it's just lying on the floor. But anyway. So that's that on 5 watts, and then we'll get it to 10, which it will go to 10 when it has a power supply connected, which it does, of course. We had the battery before. So, it's going to charge the battery a lot quicker with a decent power supply. So let's, um, we're showing a full battery when it's connected. So let's do it on 10, and then we'll transmit. There you go, 0.97. Then we'll just give a quick whistle and that'll be the end of the video. So, you saw that. Let's just give it a quick whistle now. Have a look at the amp draw when I whistle on the different powers, so. 1.30 I would say. Let's go to five watts. Yeah, about 1.10 roughly. Let's go down to 0.1 watts. one a So there you go. I, hopefully you find that interesting. This is the, the watt meter. They're only about 10, 15 pound. Uh, it's basically, um, you know, just a bit of fun here. Just 
having a look at these different radios. So 7.3 and thanks for watching. All the best.